Hello, what I have here today are two Zippo leather pouches for your Zippo lighter. One is a Harley Davidson model, and this other one is sort of an open design. And I got the one with a leather hoop rather than the metal clip. So, quick look at either of them. <clears throat> you know, this plastic cover. There's a zip on the back, snap over here, and I will test fit some uh, different zippos in there. <clears throat> Use my throat clearing. So here we go, <clears throat> excuse me again, out of the plastic. Mm, nice smell of genuine leather. Ah, love the smell of leather. You have these nice uh, foam inserts. I'm gonna give you a nice little look around either case. It's hardly Davidson one really speaks to me, being that I'm really into motorcycling. And here's this other style. <clears throat> and uh, it should also be noted that the on earlier models of these cases, the snap was exposed on the inside, which could scratch your Zippo. This case does not have it exposed, so that is safe. The same with this one. You don't see the thing exposed on the back, so these are much better than earlier models. Let's try your basic Zippo, and then I'm going to try one with a faceplate after that, as well as a, a vintage model from the 40s. So here's a standard Zippo. Well, it's a very snug fit, but of course it's leather and it will break in over time. Yeah, that's... Uh... Yeah, that leather on that will definitely need to break in a little bit over time. It is very, very snug. <clears throat> that is not easy to get out. <laughs> I'm afraid to pull this hard that it might damage the lid of my Zippo, to be honest with you. You're going to want to take some time to break in the leather on this, or maybe put some uh, oil on it to break the uh, break in the leather. Let's see how this fits in this case. Yeah, this case is better for, for getting in and out. Not quite as snug. <clears throat> Excuse me. Right off the bat. You quickly... I'm gonna get it out quickly. Thwap right underneath. So let's say if you wanted to get this out of your uh, case quick, quickly here, underneath, and you're done. I need more fluid in there. <clears throat> now let's see how it is with a thicker Zippo with a face plate. Here's your standard Zippo. Here's the one with a plate on it so that makes it a little bit thicker. So I expect it's going to be a little bit snugger. Oh, pretty good, pretty good.
quick in and out. Still a tiny bit snug. Now let's look at this back strap here. Does that come out? Yes, no, maybe. No, it doesn't feel like it pulls out. Yeah. So that's a fixed loop. <clears throat> this should fit most belts. Let's say you had approximately two inches of room, roughly two inches of room in that loop. And a vintage model, 1941. Very, it's a little bit wider than your modern. <clears throat> First put it in here. Works perfectly. Again, I need to re-add fluid in that baby. And this one fits in there just like the other ones, no problem. But it's, let me see, if you squeeze from the bottom, oh man, it's a lot more challenging getting, getting it out. To be honest, that kind of makes me a little bit nervous pulling it out until until the sucker breaks in. I don't know that I would want to put like a high value Zippo in there. I'd like break it in first with like um, a cheap cheapy Zippo, like this. This baby came with um, an eleven dollar package, twelve dollar package, with, which included lighter fluid and, uh, and a flint set. So I'd break it in with something like that versus uh, using. Uh, a slightly more expensive uh, unit like this one. Anyway, that's about it. Hope you enjoy the video. Please uh, hit that like button, subscribe if you want to see more from me. Thank you for watching. Wait, I forgot to show you what these look like on the belt. So this is this style on the belt with a vintage Zippo. Lift it up underneath and you got your Zippo out of the case. This is my first time doing this, so it shake. It's there's a lot of room to spare on this belt, so you could take you could put this in with fairly wide belts. And then on to my the next one. All right, here's how the Harley Davidson one looks on my belt. It's a lot of room there, and standard Zippo. Um, the snap comes off way too easily, so you could accidentally unsnap it, just like I did now. So, not ideal. You might actually want to go with a metal clip version. And when pulling it out, you're like, <clears throat> there you go. By the time you unclip the damn thing, you've unsnapped it. So, um... Yeah, I'm not sure that I could recommend the uh, the snap for the for this particular one. So anyway, that's about it. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe.